Hello guys, my name is Semak. Uh, welcome to my channel. And if you are new to this channel, please do subscribe guys and ring the notification bell so that you will be notified when there is an update. Um, so guys, today we want to look at the stationary distribution chain of a Markov chain. Right? We want to look at how to find the stationary distribution chain given the PTM, right? That is the probability transition matrix, right? Um, so let's consider the question given below. Uh, the question says, consider the Markov chain with three states one, two, and three, and a transition matrix which is given below. Then you are going to find the stationary distribution chain of this chain, right? So let's move on to the solution, guys, and see how do we find the stationary distribution chain, right? So the stationary distribution chain is given by <coughs> so pi multiply one pi two, right? We are just writing the formulating the matrices are uh, then is equals to pi naught pi one pi two multiplying the given matrix or the question that is uh, we have zero comma four zero comma four zero comma two then 0, 0,2, 0, 0,6, 0, 0,2, 0, 0,2, 0, 0,4, 0, 0,4, right? So this is an equation, guys, which, which is in, in matrix form, right? So we need to multiply the right hand side, right? This is simple multiplication of matrices, right? So if we simplify the right hand side, we get two. Uh, on the left hand side, we have that matrix which is equal to, if we multiply, we're going to multiply this first matrix by the first column. So if we multiply, we get 0, 0,4 pi naught plus uh, 0, 0,2 pi 1 plus 0, 0,2 pi 2. Then 0, 0,4 pi naught plus 0, 0,6 pi 1 plus 0, 0,4 by 2 and lastly we have uh, 0, 0,2 by naught plus 0, 0,2 by 1 plus 0, 0,4 by 2 right uh, now let's uh, let's write this in the in, in linear equations right so we have by naught is equal to uh, 0, 0,4 by naught right 0, 0,4 pi naught plus 0, 0,2 pi 1 plus 0, 0,2 pi 2 and let this be equation 1 then pi 1 is equals to 0, 0,4 pi naught plus 0, 0,6 pi 1 plus 0, 0,4 pi 2 and the, let this be equation 2 right then pi 2 is equal to uh, 0, 0,2 pi naught plus 0, 0,2 pi 1 plus 0, 0,4 pi 2 and let this be equation 3 right so we have a pair of linear equations a system of linear equations right so we want to solve for pi naught pi 1 and pi 2 right uh, <coughs> but before we go to that we need to know that uh, we need to know that pi naught plus pi 1 plus pi 2 is equal to 1, right? You must recall this. So we are going to solve pi naught from this uh, equation, then and use it to substitute from equation 1 and 2 and solve them simultaneously, right? So you can solve for either pi naught or pi 1 or pi 2, right? But in this case, let's solve for pi naught. Then we have pi naught is equal to 1 minus pi 1 minus pi 2, right? So we are going to substitute that pi naught in equation 1 and equation 2 and solve that, those, right? So if we substitute in equation 1, we get 2, uh, 1 minus pi 1 minus pi 2 is equal to uh, 0, 0,4, 1 minus pi 1 minus pi 2 right uh, then plus 0, 0,2 pi 1 plus 0, 0,2 pi 2 right then if we simplify this uh, we get 2 if we simplify we get 2 right we 
get to 0 0.8 pi 1 plus uh, 0 0.8 pi 2, right, is equal to 0 0.6, right, then let it be equation 4, right, then we, are, we want to substitute the same value of pi naught in equation 2, right, and solve it, right, so if we do so, we get 2 uh, pi 1 is equal to pi 1 is equal to 0 0.4 open bracket 1 minus pi 1 minus pi 2 close bracket uh, then plus 0 0.6 pi 1 plus 0 0.4 pi 2 right then if we simplify this uh, if we simplify this we get to what if we simplify we get to so if we simplify this, we get pi 1 is equals to uh, 0 0.5, right? Now we have the value of pi 1, so we can use it in, to substitute in the equation 4 to get the value of what? Of pi 2, right? So let's substitute pi 1 in equation 4 and solve for pi 2. If we do so, we get to substitute pi 1 goes to 0 0.5 in equation in equation 4 right nice so if we do so guys uh, we get to what 0 0.8 by what by 0 0.5 uh, plus 0 0.8 by 2 is equal to 0 0.6 right then if we so simplify this if we solve for pi 2 we get pi 2 being equal to what being equal to 0 0.25 right nice uh, now we have the value of what of pi 1 and the value of what of pi 2 now we want to find the value of pi naught right so to get the value of pi naught what do you do we are going to substitute the value of pi 1 and pi 2 in that value of what of pi naught and we have pi naught equal to 1 minus pi 1 minus pi 2 Right, so if we substitute pi 1 and pi 2 in that equation, uh, we get the value of what? Of pi naught, right? So if we substitute, we get pi naught equals to 1 minus uh, 0 0.5 minus uh, 0 0.25, right? Uh, then if we simplify the right hand side you get a uh, pi naught equals to 0, 0.25 right now, now we have the value of pi naught pi 1 and pi 2 right so therefore the stationary value the, ten, the stationary distribution chain is given by distribution chain is given by uh, what is given by uh, is given by pi is equal to the matrix of pi naught pi one pi two right which is a one by three polar matrix then we are now substituting the values of pi naught pi one and pi two we get two pi equals to zero comma two five zero comma five and zero comma two five right this is the stationary distribution chain of that Markov chain, right? So, guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Thank you, guys.